our community members are faced with, hey, they're tired. And so they've been extremely, extremely important in providing our, our investigators, whether it be a homicide or an aggravated assault or for this matter, I'm sure the community will step forth. IMPD is asking for your help tonight to find a man wanted in connection to a kidnapping. Authorities say the man kidnapped a nine-year-old boy while he was in the back seat of his father's car. The boy managed to get away without being hurt. CBS4 actually witnessed the heartfelt reunion moments later. CBS4's Bianca Reyes shares how you can help officers catch the man responsible. I'm just so thankful to the um, police officers and I'm really thankful unto the Lord. It was a moment some feared would not come. Family members were reunited with a nine-year-old boy after the car he was in was stolen. He, he was just happy. He was happy to see me. I was happy to see him. And I, I said a few little things to him. I said, did you pray? He said, yeah, I prayed. Investigators say the boy was sitting in his father's pickup truck, parked outside a barber shop on West 10th Street, when a man jumped in and took off. Once an officer hears that on the radio, you can imagine all hearts drop, and it's kind of somewhat all hands on deck. This is the man police say drove off with the child. Surveillance cameras show him stopping at a mobile gas station on Shelby Street. While he was inside, the boy got out of the car, ran to a nearby home, and asked for help. That neighbor called police. And I just spoke on it earlier, how much this community is doing just that. They're stepping up, they're partnering with the police department, the police department is partnering with the community because enough is enough. And so I think our community members are faced with, hey, they're tired. The truck was found nearby. This suspect, however, then stole another car that was unlocked and running. And now police need your help finding him. We're asking the community once again to come forth and provide us with information and tips. And again, you can always remain anonymous by dialing 262 tips. Reporting on the city's near west side, I'm Bianca Reyes, CBS4 News.